day to integrity is the fundamental requirement in pharmaceutical quality system. The aim of day to integrity is to prevent unintentional changes to information. Day to integrity is the, the discipline of protecting data from unauthorized personnel. Day to integrity ensures that medicinal products are of required quality. As said by someone, once lost trust cannot be easily restored. And there are no standard capers to heal branches of trust. Consequences of day to integrity in case of serious deficiencies or critical findings may lead to Prohibition of supply Withdrawn of batches from the market and Refusal or suspension on marketing authorization Regulatory authorities may take actions on SEP that is on Certificate of Suitability for API. Data integrity is not to be confused with data security or cyber security. Data integrity is different from data security and cyber security. In our current session let us see how the interview questions can be on data integrity. What is data? Data may be generated by a paper-based record of a manual observation or in terms of electronic-based record of equipment or instrument. Data can be from a receipt generated by simple machines to records of complex computerized systems. For example not only the spectrum obtained during UV analysis but also the sample weight prints obtained from weight balance are also the data for UV analysis performed. Paper-based Batch manufacturing records Batch packing records Dispensing records and Calibration records for the relevant instruments used etc. will be the data for batch manufacturing. What is data integrity? Data integrity refers to their completeness, consistency and accuracy of data. That means the data recorded on paper or in computer system should be complete, accurate and consistent. What is ALCOA? As per FDA guidelines on data integrity, data should be attributable, legible, contemporaneously recorded, original and accurate. In short form all these are called as ALCOA. What is attributable? The data generated or collected must be traceable back to the individual who generated the information. That means for suppose if you are accorded some work done on maintenance of an equipment in a paper format or in a computer system. The data recorded should clearly describe the details of person performed the maintenance of the equipment. What is legible? The data recorded must be readable and permanent. That means the data recorded should be clear and look properly for reading and the data should be recorded in a permanent format. For example if you are recording data on a paper it should be recorded by permanent ink pen but it should not be recorded by pencil which can be erased or altered later. What is contemporaneous? The data should be recorded at the time of work. That means the results measurements etc. must be recorded at the time the work is performed. What is original? The record, report, notebook etc. Where the data point was initially recorded. That means the data in which it was recorded actually should be the original data and that original data should be retained. What means accurate? The data recorded must be complete consistent truthful and representative of facts. That means the actual things happen should be recorded and the actual data should not be masked or manipulated. What is ALCOA plus? In FDA guidelines for data integrity. Data integrity requirements added with. Complete. Consistent. Enduring and. Available to ALCOA which is called ALCOA plus. 
What is complete? Information that is critical to recreating and understanding an event. That means complete information required to recreating and understanding the event should be recorded. What is consistent? The data are presented, recorded, dated or time stamped in the expected and defined sequence. That means the dates and times of activity performed or event happened should be recorded in the relevant data. This should be recorded in the sequence of sub-activities happened in the main event and dates and times of sub-activities performed should be recorded in the relevant data wherever applicable. What is enduring? The data or information must be maintained intact and accessible throughout their defined retention period. That means for example if the batch manufacturing record retention period is 5 years. The batch manufacturing record should be maintained undamaged and stored securely up to completion of its retention period of 5 years. What is available? The data or information must be able to be accessed at any time during the defined retention period. That means the data or documents should be easily accessible whenever required. What is data integrity failure? Any unintended changes to data like data deletion, amendment, duplication, reusing and fabrication, unexpected hardware failure and human error or failure of data integrity failures. For example changing analytical results, deleting original data or replacing original data with other data in HPLC are some data integrity failures. What are the common data integrity problems? Some of the common data integrity problems that have been observed by FDA inspectors are Failure to record activities at the time when activity was performed. Document backdating. Copy of existing date to as new information. Rerunning samples to obtain better results. What are the concepts of date to integrity? Metadata. Audit trail. Backup. Computer or related systems validation. Data integrity control. Other main concepts of data integrity. What is metadata? Metadata is the contextual information required to understand data. That means for suppose if there is analytical report generated by a computerized system. To understand that analytical report. We require some other reports like weighing slips or sample weights. Codes for standards etc. Which may be the metadata. In a simple way metadata is the data or background information required to understand raw data. Electronic data generated to fulfill GMP requirements should include relevant metadata. What is audit trail? Order Trail is a secure computer-generated time-stamped electronic record that allows for reconstruction of the course of events relating to the creation modification or deletion of an electronic record. An ordered trail is a chronology of the who, what, when and why of a record. Electronic audit trails track creation modification or deletion of data such as processing parameters results and actions to system level when should be the audit trail is reviewed audit trail data shall be reviewed with each record before final approval of the record what should be reviewed during audit trail review during audit trail review Changes or deletion to history of finished product test results. Changes or deletion to sample run sequences. Changes or deletion to sample identification. Changes or deletion to critical process parameters. Detection of data.
deletion adjustment modification duplication reusing and fabrication of data if any shall be reviewed. What are common data integrity failures? The common data integrity failures are changes or deletion to history of finished product test results, changes or deletion to sample run sequences, changes or deletion to sample identification, changes or deletion to critical process parameters, detection of data deletion amendment duplication reusing and fabrication of data if any shall be reviewed. What is backup? Backup is the true copy of the original data maintained securely throughout the document retention period. What is a computerized system? Computer or related system is a computer hardware, software peripheral devices, networks, cloud infrastructure operators and associated documents like user manuals and SOPs are the computer system. What are the guidelines available for performing computer system validation? GAMP 5 Udrilex Volume 4 Annex 11 are the guidelines available for guiding computer system validation. How should be the computerized system is validated? Computer systems shall be validated for its intended use. Computerized system validation should address validation of software, hardware, personnel and documentation. What is the purpose of performing installation and operational qualifications of computerized system? Appropriate installation and operational qualifications should be performed to demonstrate the suitability of computer hardware and software to perform assigned tasks. How did data integrity for electronic data is controlled? Data integrity for electronic data shall be controlled by making inputs of laboratory data by authorized personnel, by limiting permissions to change settings or data to authorized personnel, by assigning the administrator role to the person independent from originating department, by defining authorized individuals and their access privileges for each GMP computer system in use by giving strict instructions for not sharing the login credentials, by avoiding to store electronic data in temporary memory in a manner that allows for manipulation before creating a permanent record, by recording incidents related to computerized systems that could affect the product quality or the reliability of test results by implementing the practices to record data immediately after generation by reviewing electronic data based on quality risk management principles, by auditing competency of contract acceptors on implementing data integrity requirements. How do the data integrity for paper-based records can be controlled? By controlling blank forms including but not limited to worksheets, laboratory notebooks and batch manufacturing and packing records by issuing numbered sets of blank forms and to reconciliate them upon completion by kepting incomplete or erroneous forms along with the original record with written justification for their replacement by issuing bound paginated notebooks with stamping by quality department by detecting unofficial notebooks as well as any gaps in notebook pages how can you use quality risk management for data integrity control? Data integrity risk should be assessed mitigated and communicated in accordance with the principles of quality risk management. Thank you.